Blues Fan TV, Brighton 1, Chelsea 1. Uh, a bit of a drab performance. I'm too hungover to care, I can't even lie. What are you feeling? I think from the moment we walked in this afternoon, you could tell it was just going to be one of those afternoons. Even the crowd, the crowd up went up for it. For it. And which, to be fair, we were all what up. a ridiculous time to put a football match. 12.30 on New Year's Day. It was the most hungover and flat away end I've been in, particularly if, <laughs> compared to Spurs and Arsenal. Probably because we're all still hot enough Arsenal. I just saw my back was off. The ribs are still absolutely killing. Um, the game... I thought it was a promising starting lineup. I'm glad that he changed from the five that we saw against Southampton, um, and I think that it was promising. I just think Chelsea, from the moment, we didn't look like we were up for it at all. We looked lethargic, we looked slow. I don't know what the players were doing last night, but they just looked a shadow of uh, the Chelsea that should be performing on games like this. I felt that we allowed Brighton um, to defend well, because I thought Brighton actually, get fair play, hats off to them. They defended really well, and they stifled us from the back going forwards and then they really they took the chance when it came to them I thought our man of the match by far was Kepper honestly there have been times this season where he has had a couple of I don't want to say shaky moments in terms of saves but in terms of shaky moments in terms of commanding that six yard and penalty exactly box that, yeah. but today I thought he was on it and with the exception of the goal which is a world class effort he kept us in that game because there were three um, three world class saves the, the cross the one with his leg at the last minute and then that hand down low it was superb um, I thought Chelsea really failed to create anything um, and we didn't look like scoring and that's worrying me because it was similar against Arsenal we managed to gr grind out those two pretty good goals the first one was given to us similar against Southampton we felt we didn't really look like scoring. Is fatigue coming towards us because it is. We've just finished the toughest yeah, part of the season. It is. It's it's ridiculous number of games in a ridiculously small period of the uh, of, of, of days. Um, I feel Chelsea really need to rest against Forest. I feel we really need to potentially get a couple of. Uh, players in in January because Pulisic he did have a few great games but he's really not doing it for me at the moment Willian looked absolutely shattered in Tammy as much as he was trying and trying he just really didn't look like he was good and again we really need another striker to compliment Tammy because Batshuayi is not doing it for anyone I think look it was a disappointing result I felt that Brighton were going to get a cheat I said to Jordan they're going to get a cheeky fucker in at some point and they got probably one of the best goals of the season from that point of view. It was a brilliant effort. Fair play um, to them for getting in. And I thought they, they hung on for the win. We go to Forest, well, Forest come to us. We, we've got to rest. We've got to rotate. But we've got to win. We need to be in that FA Cup. And then a really, really tough game against Brighton. Uh, against Burnley, sorry. Um, I just feel... It, we take it as it comes. I feel dejected after that performance. Who cares? Frank Lampard's at the helm. Up the chest. Happy New Year.